Hello guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Karen and the name of my channel is PR Girl for Puerto Rican Girl. I hope that everyone is doing well and safe. In today's video, I have an Elfbix unboxing for you. I placed this order, I think it was at the end of November, but I didn't have time until now to share these pieces with you. December for sure has been a busy month for me. So anyhow, I'm pretty excited to show you what I got. LB released their um, collection for fall and it was totally amazing. I really love it. I feel that although it is the autumn collection, there are many pieces on that collection that I could definitely use all year round. I'm also very excited because I see that Elvis now has a new packaging and I'm just over the moon to open this and take a look at everything. As you can see, they have new boxes. It says here, experience the magic of Elvis and it also contains their website. I also saw that there is a nail file in here, which I thought it was pretty cool. This is the new Elfbeats logo and I just gonna say I love it. So fresh and different. Oh, I think it's backward. Yes, it was. Sorry about that. It is like so. I'm also placing here a few of my recent designs. In fact, I'm wearing this one for the winter season for Christmas. I love these Christmas beads. They're so amazing, so sparkly. And I designed this like probably hmm, maybe like three weeks ago. And since then, I haven't stopped wearing it. I typically combine all my designs, silvers and glass beads but for this one i don't know i felt like using it all with glass beads they're so amazing so sparkly these are from last year's or maybe the previous year's collection and i just feel they're so pretty and colorful i also designed a bracelet using those christmas beads and here are a few of them um i use some of the world beads that are matte which the colors are totally amazing and then in here i have two of the Christmas trees and winter trees. And then I still have in here a bangle design that I did for autumn. And I just love it so much that I haven't break it apart. But as you can see, the colors were very fall-like. So anyhow, I will continue with the haul. As typical, they include also a card a handwritten note and this one is so beautiful look at all these beautiful colors the gift wrapping thank you so much mila love it and yeah i'm so excited to finally take a look at this i haven't opened the package before so we will do it together so i love oh and there's a butterfly in here that's so sweet i love that and so let's see Oh, look at that. These are the new boxes that Elvis is doing. As you can see, there's the logo for Elvis, the new logo and new wording. Love that. And then the box has this beautiful ribbon. Let's take a look. Oh, and they even have new packaging before they used to have some pouches like satin pouches now they have these oh i love that love it love it love it love it and i have two of them the first one i felt a little bit weighty so perhaps we could start with this one let's see oh yes and i can see all my beads that i ordered in here yes as you can see there's some silvers some glass beads yes and they also released their new winter collection which of course eventually i hope i can grab a few pieces so let me open these and sort them out and share them with you for this haul i definitely took advantage of the promo that fbeats always has available which is the buy four get one free so i have in total 10 items to share with you and an extra one that i basically got as an exchange this B was one of the one that I was really looking forward to get. I have in total two silvers and this is one of them. This beauty is called Atria the Witch. I hope that I'm pronouncing that correctly. She was part of the Halloween collection of this year and I always knew as soon as I saw her that I needed her on my collection. She's totally magical. I love her hat, her witch hat, and also her expression. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? I just amazing. I love her dress and it seems that she's sort of like grabbing some 
like flowers or something like that in order to do a magic potion. Look at her attire, the leaves on her dress. It's just beautiful. Love, love that. Amazing details for sure. This beat was created by Myra from Shen Mood, which has collaborated a lot with Elf Beats in recent years. I always love her designs. The bottom of this bead is amazing, so magical. It seems that Adrea is around the woods grabbing some pieces to do her magic potions and her, her witch potions. And then some leaf stick underneath her dress. That's so beautiful. Look at the details of those leaves. Totally amazing, very fall like. I just love it. Let's take a look at the back. And here is the back of this bead. Look at the details of her dress in the back. Is that a bow? And then her hair, every single detail. It sort of looked like a pumpkin, but I don't know. I just, I love it, love it, love it. This bead will also look amazing next to the um, Halloween cottage or witch cottage, I think it is. Witch cottage. I have seen other collectors also design with both of them and I'm really excited to do that as well. The other silver that I grabbed won't be a surprise. This is called the Forget Me Not Bead. And I recently showed this one because I did an order with this candy shop and Mila sent me one as a token. And I love it so much that I decided to order another one. Look at the details on this one. It, it is a nice size bead that you can all use on its own, but I also feel it will be amazing as a spacer. Look at the details on those petals. Oh my goodness, so, so gorgeous. And I love the butterflies that are in the leaf in the back. So, so pretty, love it. So excited to have two. And in here we have these two beauties. The one on the left is called the Falcon Feather Sprout. And the one on the right is the Pick of Feather Sprout. They are so amazing. As we did um, four of these beads of the Feather Sprouts, these two were the ones that caught more my attention, but the other two are also very beautiful. As you can see, they're sort of like feather-like. I love the details in there. The colors they use are totally amazing to me. This one on the left has like a light blue shade as a core. And then the um, details on it are in green with an overlay, a little bit of brown. The one on the right, the bead itself, the glass bead, the core is like a light lilac or purpley color. And the details are in blue. And I think they go very nice together. Also, as part of the rebranding of the brand, Elfbeats the new silver core on the sides, as you can see. Now you see the Elfbeats and the logo and the 925. I love that, very different. And it's nice that we can have something that recognizes the brand itself. So this for me was a great move by Elfbeats and the team, Mila. So I definitely love it. And as I say, I feel that these two will play pretty nice together. So, and for sure, I will use it definitely all year round. I also see myself using this one for summer and why not for spring? They're so pretty. The other two are like a yellow color and an orangey color. Make sure you check them out because they are very pretty as well. The next bit I have in here is this beauty. This is the Oak Leaves Sunset Goddess and there's a similar one to this one, which is the base is more reddish and the leaves are more brownish. It is so pretty as well, but this one, I don't know, I gravitated towards this one more. I love the shade of the gold dust, the sunset gold dust. The leaves are so pretty with that sort of like orangey color, perfect for fall or, you know, any time of the year. The detail on the leaves are totally amazing. As you can see, they're sort of raised. We have four of them in here. And also those dark lines inside of the leaves are so pretty as well. Love this one for sure. These are the other two glass beads that I ordered that you can see that are sort of related. The one on the left is called the Sky Kiss Fall Leaves Gold Dust. And the one on the right, the Grass Carpet Leaves Gold Dust. They're so amazing. I know that LP is created like, um, if I'm not mistaken, four of these. And these two are the ones that I gravitated towards, but eventually I hope that I can grab also the other two. The one on the left is sort of like a lime green, which I absolutely love. And also the details on those, um, I would say maybe leaves, right? They have um, brown, sort of like a mustard yellowish color. And you have a few of them. I think one, two, three, maybe four or five. Let's see from this side. 
So yes, I think we have four of those. The colors are so different and so pretty, the contrast of the colors. The one on the right, love that shade of red on the inside and the sparkles, they have both of them. And here, this one, the leaves are more of a blue color. So, so pretty for sure. And here are the four of them together. And to me, I will definitely use them like that on a design. To me, they look very cohesive. They go with each other because they are sort of like similar colors, like the lime green in this one goes really well with the um, green on the um, falcon feather sprout. And then also the um, pick of feather sprout goes really nice with the blue on the grass carpet leaf gold dust. And then also the orangey red that we see on this oak leaf sunset gold dust goes really nice with the red on this one. So I will definitely use them like that. When I do my Elfbeats orders, I always like to, of course, grab pieces from recent release collection, but also there's so many on my wish list that I also try to grab pieces from previous collections. And the ones that I'm gonna share with you now are some that I have been wanting for some time. So let me show you. These beauties are called the Space Storm Bead. And if I'm not mistaken, I think these were released last year for the winter season. I believe these were part of their Space and Star collection, which was so beautiful and magical. And these beads I have wanted for some time now. I felt also that these were going to be so cool to design with during winter because they have sort of like a magical look of like stormy, snowy weather to me. These are so different and amazing. In fact, I know because I have seen pictures, of course, Elvis released their new winter and Christmas collection and they sort of recreated this type of bead with red color and blue, very beautiful. But as you can see, like half of this bead is sort of like a creamy beige color. They are opaque. And the other side, oh my goodness, this is so magical. Look at that. The tones in here are... Um, like with green, some red, some metallic, so, so gorgeous. Love that swirl. And they also have those bombs in this one. I feel one, two, three of those bombs and then some swirls that you can see here. Let me show you the side of the other one because of course, as these are handmade, they can vary a little bit. And I see the lighting is changing on my video. Not sure why, but here they are. And here is also how the previous elf beads looks, used to look. The new one, as I showed you before, the core is different, which I really like. But as I said, these beads are gonna be so cool to design during winter for winter designs. They're so pretty. And make sure you take a look at the ones they just released. Perhaps I can include a picture here for you to see because they're also really cool. This bead that I'm gonna share with you now is part of the Petite line. This is called the Blush World Petite Dewdrops. And I feel like I wanted to get some more um, beads in the Petite line that have pink. You guys know my, that pink is my favorite color. And I thought that this one, which is a world bead, was gonna be nice to have. I love the raised bumps on it. The details are so pretty and the pinkish color will be perfect for my collection. Love that. So those were the 10 beads that I ordered it with the buy four, get one free. Love them so much. This one was an exchange. This is the Butter Flower Stone. I ordered the Butter Flower Stone on my previous order, but I got the Tripartual instead, which I already had. And so I got this one now. It is very pretty. I'm trying to collect most of the Flower Stone, Flower Fields, and Tripetuas, it's, I think I'm missing like maybe two or three from the Tripetuas, but they haven't been in stock. So I'm trying to, as I said, collect these because are so, they are so classic and they will look amazing with many designs. The colors on this one are so beautiful. I love that also they are opaque. This one has sort of like a grayish um, core, as you can see. And the flower petals are in a lime green shade. They will look also pretty nice with the ones that I showed you previously from this um, autumn collection. So those were the beads that I ordered. And I see there's an extra pouch in here. Oh, this one says, I didn't realize this. It reads Elf Beats Gift. I didn't saw that previously. I just read it now. So I'm guessing, of course, that these are gifts they sent me. Oh, I feel another one in here. So I can tell there are 
silvers. Oh, wow. These are from the recent release Christmas collection. Oh, thank you so much. That's exciting. This first bead that I'm going to show you, it's called the Snowflake Dangle. And I'm pretty excited about that because I don't have many of Elpid's Dangle. I just have maybe like two or three. Wow, look at the snowflakes. And I think they do contain a CC inside of them. I'm going to double check that on the website. But I just love the detail on the snowflake. The six points on it is so pretty. And look at the bail. Also, the bail has a pretty nice detail to it. It is very thick and wide, and I love that. It looks like an ornament to me as well. So pretty, so beautiful. This collection from the Christmas winter collection is so nice. There's also a can that I would try to insert some pictures in here that I definitely want to grab for my collection. This other bee is called Joyful Lights, and I have seen this one on Instagram. It is very beautiful, like a spacer, and it will frame pretty nice many of the beads i feel that i for sure would need another of this one look at the side isn't that sort of looking like a bell wow and the swirl details on it look at all the lights we have green we have purple blue red yellow green oh my goodness this is so pretty so that's why it's called joyful lights love that so much perhaps i could bring some beads and we can put it next to it so here is joyful light next to one of the world beads from a previous collection for a previous christmas collection and i love it i will for sure need another one how amazing will look like this like having the world bead and then flanking it by two of these joyful lights so so beautiful I also have in here this beautiful bangle design. I place in here the snowflake dangle and also these space storm beads that I got as well as this one from the autumn collection. But I still feel that even though they're part of the autumn collection, they look pretty nice with many other beads and designs. So I love it. So, so beautiful look at the details on that dangle and it's really heavy you guys it's really heavy very nicely made love it thank you so much Elfitz and mila for those kits and here is a look at it on my wrist i also wanted to share with you a design featuring atria de wish as well as some of the new glass beads i'm gonna say that i really love the new design of the glass beads and their core they feel sort of like smoother and then also I don't know, I, I think wider in a nice way, uh, more round. I'm not sure how to describe it, but I really, really love it. And in here, as I said, I have placed some of these um, feather sprouts as well as the um, fall leaves gold dust. They're so beautiful. And as I said, they work really nice together, don't they? And Atria is so magical. Love it. Well, guys, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoy watching. Make sure you go to the LP website because they have so many beautiful pieces, particularly from this fall collection as well as the new winter Christmas collection. They have some glass beads with Christmas lights that are so, so pretty. Some of them even glow in the dark. So make sure you check them out. Thank you so much, Elfies, for the gifts that you sent me for this new collection. Love them so much. And if you enjoyed watching, as I always say, please remember to give me a thumbs up and consider subscribing to my channel. I will really appreciate having you here. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye. Gracias.